Welcome back everyone, I am the Depressed Eeyore, and this is Our Darker Purpose. Alright, so the last session didn't go... well, it went well until it crashed. Uh, unfortunately, crashing in this game is pretty costly. Um, I'm hoping that was just a fluke, because that was the first time I've ever crashed in the game. Um, but if it continues happening, I might have to put this on hiatus, so just letting you guys know ahead of time if I start suffering more technical issues. Um, simply because I can't save the game, it's just how these sorts of games are, unfortunately. But, um, let's go ahead and start a new game. We'll see how this goes. So my goal for this one is not necessarily to get to the end, but to get to past chapter 2 without using a single vending machine. Which is going to require me to remind myself multiple times, because I usually like going straight for the vending machines because I like buying items. So, we'll see how that goes. Alright. Um, health or tokens? Well, I don't need tokens, that's for sure, so... Oops, can't use that. There you go. So I already right off the bat I start with 125 health, and anytime I use a juice box I will get back um I'll get an additional four to my max health. I'm gonna go ahead and pick up every token though, just in case I ever get that ability to um increase my damage based off my tokens. Because if I do, that would be freaking awesome. Definitely need damage. That's probably the only thing I'm kind of annoyed with is it's really hard to increase my damage. It feels like. Um, I mean, it's kind of a problem in all of these types of games. Like Binding of Isaac has the same issue where you're pretty much re relying on um, the drops in order to progress because the bosses at the end have so much health. machine not gonna touch it not gonna even look at them go figure oh so I already have uh, the crit item which means I'm gonna lose it very quickly At least I can two shot these guys now. All right. Ah, uh, figures. I tried to teleport, but I was holding the wrong key, so I tried to teleport into a wall, and so it didn't go anywhere. That thing fell down a flight of stairs. That's it. Cool. Ah, flamey. Or frothy, rather. I mean, it's the name of the freaking dragon from Secret of Mana. Uh, I took a hit for no reason. There we go. Well, at least I killed it quickly. Alright, well, let's go ahead and step on out here. Try not to get hit by the freaking spike walls of death. Alright. There we go. Got an A. Uh, pitch black or sensitive. We'll go with sensitive because that's ridiculous. So now I'm doing f crit damage with dub that's all doubled. Though at the same time I will take extra damage from anything. Everything. Ugh. Okay. 
Okay. This gives me uh, extra credits, which is always good because I actually need those. But for those who don't know, I don't, I don't grind it uh, for this let's play. Every set, every attempt you guys see on screen, so you guys can see every bit of progression I do. I mean, mainly that's because there's always that potential. I I find a new boss or a new item or just new, you know, new plot overall. So. That's why I don't do anything off screen. Now, if I wasn't Let's Playing this, I would be playing this a lot more. Uh, movement or damage. I will happily take the damage. So now I do even more. Alright, that's one. Thousand nine damage. Yay for sensitive rooms. All right. Okay, juice box. And a boss already. I will definitely fight the boss so I can get as much damage out as possible. Of course, if I get hit by the boss, I'm going to take a lot of health and possibly break the dish. There we go. Boss dead. I'm still going to explore all the rooms just to get items, um, but I, I still will not use the uh, vending machine, which I'll probably tell myself multiple times verbally during this playthrough so I can, you know, actually make sure I don't open them, use them by accident. Oh, almost got him. Or her, rather. It's hard to tell. Could be a guy with a mullet. But that person is also wearing a skirt. More chalk. I'm, I'm already carrying four pieces of chalk. Not that I use chalk that often. There's really only a few specific moments where I actually force myself to use chalk. This being one of them. I mainly do that just to make sure I get all the experience. Alright, so now anyone that touches me will take damage. Not that big of a deal. It's better than nothing, of course. Alright. Yeah, that's a vending machine. Alright, don't use the vending machine. It has nice things in it. And you have 31 tokens. You can buy two items, but don't go to the vending machine. Okay, um, 15 life and more likely to drop tokens, which is not useful to me. Or 5 damage and then higher chance to drop everything. We'll go ahead and take that. Okay. 21 credits, awesome. Uh, too small or underlit. 
We'll go with underlit, that's fine. I don't really like underlit, but I don't like having all my rooms, so. Okay. Yay, token. Let's try this. Oh my god, I, I, I dodged that. I, that was that was epic. Alright. Great, more of these guys. At least the firewall. Yeah, of course I got hit. Took 8 damage, that's not too bad. It's no longer a sensitive floor, so... I really don't like it when they have the enemies right next to the door, especially ones that rush like that. It's kind of a cheap way of hitting people. Okay, and that's gonna give, make my shots ricochet. Hey, I killed him. <laughs> that was the only enemy in there. All right. Alright, boss room already. That could have went better. Uh, how are we doing on the dish? Uh, 46 health. And it's lasted longer than usual. What I should do is really kill the minion, but I kind of lose track of everything when I try doing that stuff. Come on, dodge. Well, grab that in a second. All right, so we are pretty much done here. So I'll go ahead and drink that. down to 38 yeah 
I'll probably lose it next floor. Alright. We got this far again. And once again, we have another secret room available to us. Um, cover health. Um, or deal more damage once I get low on health. Um, I like ha I'll go for the uh, extra health and the get health back from tokens. Oh, awesome! And you got the freaking stake again. So we get back twenty percent percent of our health after each floor, which is quite a bit at this point. Essentially, we're getting about thirty-two health. Uh. Yeah, 32 health per floor now. Okay. I also lost track of the ghost guy. Okay, it looks like he went down, I think. him again. 16 damage, holy cow. Extra experience. Okay, so no seek, no uh, no lore, but we did get an item out of it, so that's always good. Okay. Nice to have to dish for the boss fight, but that doesn't look like it's gonna be happening. Okay, there's the vending machine. Wow, I almost killed them all. Alright. Shots extend at random angles beyond the usual range. So our weapon our shots have infinite range now, but they go off once they go beyond the usual. Well they don't have infinite range, but they're pretty close. Which will actually be really good for this upcoming boss fight, because then I can just pretty much spray and pray with my shots. Oh, I took a hit there. I was hoping I could teleport through and I failed. Failed you all. You know what? Let's, uh, 
Let's head on up here real quick. Make a juice, bo juice box, and we'll just head on down. Really, I just wanted the bonus health. Because who doesn't? Alright. So, this is our only route left. Hey, I can see the guy right through the wall. Neat. Okay, and nothing else in the room. Boss fight time, let's do this. Okay, that's one. Oh, and I lost my crit. But now I can take as many hits as I want. Of course, it means I get less points and, you know, uses up resources, but whatever. Buildings taken care of. Those little faded clouds are kind of hard to see. Oh, this is going to take forever. I mean, I think it's because I'm technically in chapter 4 now or whatever number we're at. I think we're at chapter 4 now. And I think, despite the fact um, these are the same levels, they make them more difficult every time you go up a chapter. That's my only thought on it. Okay, just you and me. Goneril. to teleport through now. <laughs> There you go. Let's go get ourselves a juice box. We also leveled up. 20% um, attack speed or more health. We're going to go ahead and we'll go with attack speed. The attack speed's awesome. And I think we have time for one more level, possibly.
or at least get close to finishing another level. So I might go ahead and keep going. Alright, uh, we should be at full health for the next floor because of the uh, stake item that we got. We're also up to 47 tokens. Okay, 34 uh, credits there, good. Uh, wealthy, too small, and power struggle. We'll go with power struggle. This will up the prices of vending machines, but that doesn't affect us at all, because we're not using vending machines. Oh wow, pretty amazing. All right, takes care of you. Bad damage. At least killing them relatively quickly. <laughs> Got a chunk of health back and then took another hit. Always good. Okay, got everything. Just have the juice box, of course. Hello. Attacks have... Oh, cool. I could do um, instant death at hits now. Which means we definitely want as much attack speed as possible. Doesn't work against bosses, unfortunately. Alright. right into it. Okay. God, I'm just taking hits left and right now. Uh, 50% slow on hits, always good. Um, let's backtrack real quick. When I grab that juice box. juice box as well and now we have 178 HP as our top. We also now get four health per token. Always nice. <laughs> Teleported right into it. Alright. Love to have more uh, slow on hit uh, items if possible.
Yay, instant death. Another instant death. Wow. Really getting pretty good luck with those. Alright. Taking hits for no reason. But it doesn't matter. I'm going a little over time, but I'll go ahead and try the boss. See how this goes. Actually, no. Let's, um... I'm gonna clear out everything, and then we'll go to the boss as a final thing. Since I don't have any juice boxes to worry about right now. That, and I don't want to start the next video with me just backtracking to check out one room. Eh, tokens. Correction, two rooms. Ah, uh, screwed that up. Oh well. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and pop that juice box. Oop. There we go, 182 health. Alright, we're just gonna go stop at the boss and we'll call the video there and then we'll start it next video off with a uh, bang, I guess. So far, we're doing pretty good. We're, we're, we're making progress through the chapter, this uh, second chapter. If we can complete this chapter, um, we'll have the achievement. Anyway, I'm the Depressed Dior. This was our darker purpose. See you guys later.